fans of Stabby on Days of Our Lives are likely more than a little frustrated at this point, which is understandable. The marriage between Stefan and Gabby ended after he passed away four years prior. However, when he was ultimately revived in the fall, he had been indoctrinated into loathing her. He moved on with Chloe. Gabby came close to marrying Lai. The truth eventually came to light, and they were finally separated. After a few failed attempts at deprogramming, a six-month marriage commitment, and a plot to take over Demera, the two haven't gotten back together. Nothing seems to be working at this point. Only EJ, nothing else. Say what? EJ, however, has a burning hatred for Gabby, perhaps, but he has never hesitated to use anything or anyone to further his goals, and his current goal is to eliminate Stefan. Dan Fuerigal reports in the most recent issue of Soap Opera Digest that EJ and Nickel decide to play matchmaker for Stefan and Gabby. They manage to persuade Stefan to go along with it, and they set up Stabby in the Salem Inn under a false identity with the intention of giving him whatever he desires. Maybe not everything, men. Furibel tells Digest, It's all about screwing Gabby so the agreement is breached and Lai won't have to give her his shares. Gabby was persuaded by Stefan to continue her marriage to Lai in order to obtain his shares. He will not be pleased if he loses those, not initially, at least, because, according to Furibel, They'll have the majority if the two of them combine their shares after six months. They can vote Stefan out if she doesn't. Lai might serve as EJ's right-hand man and serve as CEO. They'll fire Stefan and Gabby. Everything is incredibly easy. The problem is that if EJ and Nicole succeed and Gabby loses her chance at the shares, she will also have no reason to continue her marriage to Lai. She might instantly file for divorce from him and get back together with Stefan. Stefan would continue to own a stake in Demera, even if she would be unable to combine her shares with his. Their individual shares could never have taken control of Demera. They would still have to put together a loose partnership. Lai is nothing if not tenacious, and six months is a long time. Gabby may have been pushed back into Stefan's arms if EJ had been more patient and waited to see what transpired. Stefan would lose the shares, the woman he loves, and a scheming partner if she decides to recommit herself to lie. The island would be his alone. Nevertheless, if EJ and Nicole are successful, all it would do is forge a real power couple, giving them the opportunity to plot with their backs to the wall and become more powerful than ever as a team, which is where they both thrive. Although putting together a Demera alliance would be challenging, when those two are working together, nothing is certain. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, Daily Bulletin News, and stay with us.